Hello, Scorpio. It's Milady from Milady Sway Tarot. And I'm coming to do your weekly weekend, I'm sorry, weekly love reading for the week of April 13th through the 20th, 2020. The cards I am using today are Oracle of Visions by Kiro Marchetti. And I'm closing off with my Tarot Apocalypticis by Eric Dune and Kim Huggins. I want to thank everybody for like, sharing, subscribing, and setting up for some reading with me. Alright guys, let's get this show on the road. Alright, what's going on with the Scorpio? I just saw that card flip upside down. That was crazy. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? All right, so we got the number six card here. This is about peace. This is about balance, okay? This is about tranquility, okay? Mm -hmm. All right, so I do feel like somebody was definitely into themselves, all into themselves, okay? Everything was about them. I feel like now somebody having a different um, thought, different frame of thought, okay? I do feel like it's about everybody else now. All right, so we got the intuition card here, Harmony. I do feel like somebody is more focused on other people on the outside, and I do feel like somebody's getting all kinds of messages, I feel like, for people around them as well, okay? And I do feel like somebody is okay not being the center of attention, okay? Okay, so I do feel like somebody's changing as a person. I do feel like somebody's getting ready to close the door to um, that it's all about me um, attitude, okay, and start focusing on everything and everybody. Okay. Okay, yes. So I don't know what's happening, but I do feel like this little uh quarantine thing has everybody more aware of what's going on and more caring of others okay so i do feel like somebody but it's also making people care about other people more than they care about themselves which is sort of good because it keeps you protected but i do feel like somebody people are starting to neglect their self to take care of others okay so i don't know I don't know. It's, it's definitely a double-edged sword here, okay? Because I do feel like somebody is used to taking care of themselves. Everything is about everybody else. But now I feel like somebody is not even doing just normal stuff for themselves, trying to help other people, okay? I do feel like somebody is at peace with this. Um, and I do feel like it's, it's making someone a better person, okay? But you got to take care of yourself, okay? So definitely... Keep taking care of others, but make time for you, even if it's 30 minutes, okay? All right. Okay, so it seems like at first somebody did not like the person that they were turning into. I do feel like somebody was putting on some kind of uh, fake character to fit in, okay? Okay, that's good. So it seems like somebody is not being that character anymore. Okay, so it seems like somebody did not want to do all that. So it seems like somebody is definitely um, being they self. Okay, so I do feel like whew, somebody just not going above and beyond. Okay, somebody just don't want to. I, I guess if you got many uh, tens of years, uh, maybe a couple decades or, you know, five, six, seven years of putting on whatever somebody telling you to put on, do what everybody telling you to do when it's time for you to not have to do anything, you're not going to do nothing. And then your heart is coming out. Ooh, this made my heart feel so warm. Okay. So somebody is definitely by seeing this, it's just relaxing, like being what they want to be. Okay. So I do feel like this is like who somebody is. And this is like who everybody wanted them to be okay and i definitely understand that because a lot of us go the extra mile trying to be a certain way for a certain group of people at work or for the internet and now nobody has to do that anymore 
Nobody has to do that. Even just for a little while, somebody is like, break time. <laughs> so I understand now. I understand. All right. So I do feel like with all this going on, I do feel like even though it let out a bunch of good things, it also let out a bunch of bad habits as well, okay? Um, yeah, somebody is going as far as like not taking a shower. <laughs> Little stuff like that I feel like somebody is, is not doing. Um, I say if you ain't going nowhere, shoot, you don't have to, okay? But I do feel like it's letting out a lot of bad habits. So it seems like some of the stuff that you're doing now in relax mode, you might end up taking that back to um, work life, okay? So it's good to, you know, take back some of it uh but not all of it okay you can't go to work after not showering for three days i mean you can but yeah i do feel like somebody's turning into they self a little bit which is good okay good things all right so yeah i do feel like somebody is not um caring for they self they caring for other people right now, okay? Somebody's letting their emotions, letting their heart out. Um, and in, in this time that we're in now, somebody is giving in, instead of taking, okay? So that's a good thing, okay? Of course, this is what happens, okay? So I do feel like somebody is doing some self-sacrificing to help and do other things for other people. And I do feel like this is going to bring blessings and luck to you, okay? which is awesome, okay? But just worry about some of those habits, okay? So good habits die hard, okay? <laughs> Believe me, I know. All right, let's see what's going on with these Tarot Apocalypticist cards. What's going on? Oh, for the Scorpio. Okay, that don't want to do that, so I'm not going to make it do nothing. It does not want to do, okay? I'm going to try one more. What's going on? All right, there we go. With the Scorpio. Scorpio, Scorpio, Scorpio. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? All right, so we got the devil card reversed here. So I do feel like, yeah, I heard control. Somebody's uh, getting away from some kind of control, some kind of negative energy, some kind of negative atmosphere. I do feel like somebody's trying to let that go. Um, I do feel like a bit of manipulation is going on here as well, okay? So I do feel like that's this, I got to do this, I got to do that. So it seems like somebody's completely um, rebelling or reverting um from whatever that situation was all right so we got prince of pentacles here so i do feel like some kind of money or things are getting ready to come in all right so we got the king of wands reversed here um so i do feel like some kind of disloyalty is getting ready to happen or happen happening okay um or are you just getting ready to see this disloyalty and become free from it All right, so we got the King of Pentacles. So I do feel like somebody is getting ready to take over something that they're doing themselves, okay? I do feel like emotionally somebody's getting ready to leave a situation, getting ready to become free from a situation. And I do feel like somebody's getting ready to start something over by their self, okay? Let's see what's going on here. All right, so we got the Prince of princess of swords here so i do feel like yeah of course people watching you trying to see what's going on what you're doing okay um i do feel like there's still going to be a monetary gain coming in no matter what you do here okay all right so we got the prince of swords reversed so, yeah, I do feel like somebody going to try to call you out. People going to start trying to say anything about it. I feel like you're not going to 
jump in with that, okay? So this could be happening to somebody you know. It doesn't have to be happening to you, okay? But I feel like somebody is not going to fight back. They're not going to be uh, reacting to any comments that are made to them, okay? So let's see what's going on with this King of Pentacles. One card, please. So we got the Queen of Swords here. So yeah, I do feel like somebody's just going to keep standing firm on what they're doing and they're not going to let any situation or any person um, come in and change what they're doing. I do feel like somebody got some luck or some blessings coming to them and I do feel like somebody's not letting anybody negative uh, impact come into that, okay? Mm -hmm. I'm going to be who I am and do what I do. All right. So Ten of Wands. Yeah, so definitely somebody's changing their lifestyle here. I do feel like somebody was just feeling like it was too much to hold up this whole lifestyle thing. And now they're relaxing and doing what they feel like they want to do and what they want to do. Okay. All right. But that's all I have for you guys. Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. Thanks for watching.